These two gentlemen will be competing for points in those welterweight standings. Courteous Curtis Millinder taking on the Red King, Rory McDonald, who makes his final highly anticipated debut. Kenny Florian, Rory McDonald. We've talked about him a lot. We've talked to him a lot. This is it. The debut finally happening. He promised us the best version of himself. And I think we're going to see it. This is a fighter with a ton of experience. Again, an elite fighter in the welterweight division for several years now. He's been working extremely hard for this and wants to show all of his new tricks tonight. It's a lot of sacrifice on the line for Rory McDonald and his family to finally get here. Bill Andrews got a lot at stake, too. He's got a six-year-old all the way down to a 10-month-old, three boys that he's fighting for. He, Roy McDonald moved from Canada to Florida. Tri-Star to Sanford MMA. This is the guy who's synonymous with Canadian MMA. He had to relocate to the States. And that's the guy who looks to pull off the upset tonight. Randy, he really believes to the core of his being, he could do it. He absolutely says he's dreamt about this fight for a very, very long time. And this format really suits him. He believes winning this season will be huge for him and his family. Millinder McDonald. We take a look at the tail of the tape brought to us by Presidente. Millinder, two years older, two inches taller, but he gives up a reach in the arms to the Red King, Rory McDonald. How does it play out? The main event with Lillian Garcia. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event. And it is in the welterweight division. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner. He is a striker. Standing at 6'2", he weighs in officially at 171 pounds. In 24 professional bouts, he has a record of 18 wins with six losses, with six victories by knockout. Fighting out of Fullerton, California, by way of San Bernardino, here is Curtis Curtis Millinder. His opponent, fighting out of the red corner, he is a mixed martial artist. Standing at six feet tall, he weighs in officially at 170 and one half pounds. In 28 professional bouts, he has a record of 21 wins, six losses, and one draw, with 14 victories by stoppage. Fighting out of Montreal, Quebec, Canada, here is the Red King, Rory McDonald. Your referee in charge, Keith Peterson. Rory McDonald, heavy betting favorite, coming into the main event tonight. Keith Peterson will oversee. The action, Kurt, Curtis Millinder, black and gray trunks, Rory McDonald in the red and blue. Sir, are you ready? Sir, are you ready? Fight! And just like that, main event underway, they take the center of the cage. That's it, that's my Both in the orthodox stance. Long jab attempt there from Curtis Millinder. Yeah, you're gonna watch for those long range weapons from Millinder. He also possesses an excellent blitzing attack from the outside. Nice little head fake by Roy McDonald. Make him think you were gonna shoot that tape down. McDonald ate that jab. Nice low kick, compromises the balance of Rory McDonald. Rory has an excellent jab himself, and my feeling is that he's gonna look to try to clinch and take Millinder to the mat. Randy Millinder promised a strong takedown defense. He thinks that's what's coming as well. Good. Light on those toes. We're going to count that interesting to see if he can sprawl and keep Roy from getting in deep, tripping or putting him on the ground. I can attempt there from Curtis Millinder. Slaps off the arms of Rory McDonald. Jab almost Good. sneaks Watch through. No hop, no hop. Hook tested out there by Roy McDonald. There's the double entry. Switches it to a single. Head inside. Tries to run the pipe. Nice defense so far from Curtis Millinder. Start the motorcycle, Curtis. Start the motorcycle with that leg. Get back to it. Get back to it. Roy's got to be careful in here. He spent a lot of energy trying to score this takedown. That's a lot of wear and tear on the arms. Good balance here by Curtis Millinder. 
McDonald the using the head to try and Get dump Curtis Miller back ring. over his own right hip. Good. Roy trying all the tricks, changing directions, trying to run the pipe, trying a little cross pick. Good, Curtis, you're good right here. You're good. McDonald thought about a double leg good. transition. Millender spread the legs. McDonald thought rip. better of it. Millender doing a good lock. job of defending this takedown so far. Rory looking for that double leg. He's trying to clasp his hands around both of the legs of Millender. If he can do that, it's going to be a much easier takedown. He's getting pretty deep with that knee position. There's Just the like hand that. mark right there. He gets it, but that is enough to score the takedown. Millender surrenders it. Uh -oh. Yeah, Millender is not in a good position. Rory already in half guard in advancing position. Oh, Millender got his back. back. Hooks in for Rory. He's going to flatten him out, and from here it's going to be pretty easy. Rear naked choke. Keep the hand fighting going. Good. Don't let him building the base. A couple hammer fists for him to think about. And he rolls. Roy McDonald has the left wrist of Curtis Millinder. Do not wait there. Can't protect himself with it. Put some pressure on that leg. Put some pressure on this on this bigger floor over here. Keep Two minutes hands. left. Stay Two minutes is a long one. time to have the Red King on your back, Kenny Florian. It sure Shoulder is. Blades. The coach for Curtis Shoulder Millinder is trying to tell him to put some pressure on the left leg of Roy McDonald. There is a little footlock attack you can, you can do from that position, but very difficult to do. And now Millinder is on the wrong on the side. Roy McDonald working to try to get that leg. arm underneath the neck of Millinder. Nice defense so far for Millinder. Some heels to the thigh for him to think about. There's the rear naked jump underneath the chin. Will it be enough? Millinder peels the top hand off. This is going to be it, guys. the tap. The Red King successful in his PFL debut. First round submission. That was a clinic there from Roy McDonald. Once it hit the mat, it was all the Rory. There was nothing Curtis could do. Rory McDonald. He signed in December 2019. The pandemic forced him, along with a lot of other fighters, to take an extended absence. He told us, I worked on my body, I worked on my mind. He feels like he's in the best place he's been in a long time. And that performance is indicative of exactly that. No question about it. Very technical. Was looking for that takedown. Was eventually able to get it. Was careful at range. Millinder hung in there for a little while, but dominant performance on the map from Roy McDonald. We'll take a look at the Cajunomic stat bundle presented by Geico. It was early and it was a submission. The takedown really spelled the difference for Rory McDonald. Our co-main event and our main event, first round finishes via submission. Ray Cooper the third was just a little bit faster, so he gets a, a prettier six points, I suppose. Only the top four advance to the playoffs, two regular season bouts, then the playoffs in the pursuit of a $1 million championship. Rory McDonald and Ray Cooper, each with six points. And Roy McDonald's still drilling inside the cage. <laughs> you're you're going to tell me this guy's not excited it's to be back? Every chance to learn, Absolutely. Man. He's a true martial artist, guys. Lillian Garcia makes it official. Ladies and gentlemen, the starting time officially at 3 minutes and 38 seconds of round number one. Submission by rear naked choke, earning six points in the welterweight. 